Oh, hey, everybody. George the Tech. Yeah, it's me. Pretty obvious, right? I'm right there on the website. Good to see everybody. And I want to give you a quick tour of our new website. I'm so excited that the launch is coming. We've worked so hard on this with the team at Skills Hub to get this up online and debugged and set up for you. And so let's get to it. Let me show you where everything is on the site and where you'll manage your account and get access to all of your bookings and such. So as you can see, we're right on the main site. At the very top, you've got a big red button. So if you know you need help right away, click that red button. That's gonna get you to the service that is our 911 service where you can call in and get ASAP support, usually within an hour or less. On the left-hand side, this is where, for all of you who are new to the site or new to George the Tech and you just don't know what service to get, you've got a lot of things you wanna talk about and you're not sure, click Start Here. That's gonna take you to the service that we want you to start with, which is our consultation. Now you'll have on the website an access through this scheduling system, a number of different technicians who are on our team. Each team member, you'll see their name in abbreviation on the calendar. So when you see RG, that's gonna be Rich Green or Richard Green. If you see MM, that's gonna be Mike McGonigal. TF is gonna be Tim Friedlander. So you'll see you'll have access to a variety of technicians that you can book with as a first timer. I showed you the top two items on the menu bar. Those are for people that need help right away or don't know where to start. But the main service area, if you scroll down, you'll see a book today, which is the starting point. And you can browse our services here on the right. Custom reviews, if you wanna peruse them, we have 157 and counting of great testimonials. And down below, you'll see a listing of all the webinars that we have currently available to stream on demand or in the schedule for the future. It's all right here on the front page. But if you like menus, look at the menu bar and you'll see services, mouse over services, and you can do a starter consult here. You can view all of our services, or if you wanna get a studio design started, click over here on the studio design consult button. So we'll click down on view all services and take a look at everything that's available. We have a lot of different options for you guys right here. Now on the left-hand side, hidden beneath me, let's shrink me down, you'll see there's some filters. So if you wanna see only the services that have online booking, check the online booking box, and now it's only gonna show the services that are available for live online booking, right? These are all the services that are scheduled with one of our technicians. If you wanna know more about a service, you can click on the big button, the icon or the graphic, and take a look at it. Clicking view service will do the same. And this explains how the Rush service works with all the details. If at any point on the website, something's confusing about the site itself, it seems like a bug or it's not working, fill out the report a bug area down below and our developer Bill will get right on it. Or if you just have questions in general about customer service or services we provide, fill that have questions out on the right hand side and we'll get right to you. We also have our webinars and modules area webinars are the live events, and the training modules are videos that I produce offline that are not live. And so there's a mixture of both. And you can stream through and see them all kind of jumbled here together in one giant list, or you can filter by categories. At this time, we're developing the filter by category feature, but in the future, you'll be able to choose certain styles of software, brands, etc and filter down the list as this list gets longer and longer. Once you're in there, look for any availability you see in the calendar. Hey, there's GW, that's me. So I'll click on this availability. Once I click on it, down below it says the following texts are available. There I am, I'm the founder. Click book service. Once you're in here, this is where you'll probably now at this time realize, oh, I don't have an account yet. So this is the point where you'll make a new account. So you can go ahead and do that. It says optional phone number. Please put a phone number in. I really appreciate it. All right, you can have it remember you. So next time you come in and you log in automatically, click sign up and continue. There you go. Now, once you've completed the creating your account process, you can finish the booking process. 
If you want to book 15 minutes with me, just to ask me everything you possibly can, go ahead and choose 15 minutes. If you want more time, you can choose the hourly rate, but you can choose less than one hour. Click on Choose Technician. George Whittem is the only one. And you can select session times starting as short as 30 minutes or up to two hours. So let's say you want to do 30 minutes. Choose the beginning of the time slot and the end of the time slot, and that will put in a booking for you. If you choose 15 minutes only, it's going to tell you it's too short because you should have chosen the 15-minute service. Otherwise, if you want 30 minutes, choose a start and end time that gives you 30 minutes. Now, if you choose a longer window of time, let's say from 1 to 2.30, the system will think that you're wanting to book 90 minutes. Okay? So just remember, always check your start and end time, and that's going to give you the amount of time you want to book and when. The total cost, and then click Go to Payment. This is where you'll enter your payment information, complete your payment information, and once you've entered your payment information, that will be stored in the system for the next time. If you got a coupon code, such as the one that I've sent out with the newsletter promoting the new website, you can enter that here and click apply and it will give you the discount. Then click book service. Once you're in this window, you can type a message to whoever you're working with. Hey George, I'm looking forward to this and I record in a club. Send a message. You can send more messages if you want. All right, now that you have a booking, you've paid for it and it's been scheduled, you're now going to be shown your bookings area where you can come back anytime and you can add files if allowed. This particular service doesn't have a file upload area, but most services do where you'll be able to choose and upload a file. And again, this is where you're going to chat with your technician in the chat area. The technicians don't receive emails. All they receive are notifications letting them know that there are messages available to them and they will do all their communication with you here. If the technician provided to you a Zoom link or some other meeting link for you to meet with, that link will be in this area right now that says link pending. So check there. If they didn't provide that to you, send in the message via chat. How are we connecting? And they will send you the link to join them for the session. If I click on the account button in the upper right hand corner, this takes me to my account portal, which shows everything about my account. You can change email password, change your payment information, if you want to see what bookings you already have pending, click on the My Bookings button at the very top, and this will show you the bookings that are currently open and closed. Closed bookings will be in the historical area. If you have any webinars you've booked, that'll be under My Webinars at the top. No webinars booked yet. If you need to log out for some reason, you can click Log Out, and then I'll take you to this screen here. If you ever need to log back in, just click the login button in the upper right hand corner, log back in, and it takes you right back to here again where you can go back, check your services, and just look for other information you want on the website. We always do provide free resources. And on this page, you'll see a menu of several different features that we actually offer totally for free. Now this area is under development. We'll be adding more content here over time, but all that free stuff that you used to read on the old site is right here under free resources. And you can read some of the customer reviews, as well as our studio gallery, which people love to look through and see the kinds of projects that we've designed and built. And any media mentions, any recent interviews of myself personally are here. So that's it. That's the new site. Hope you found it easy to browse and find everything you're looking for. And I'm really looking forward to helping you guys out and welcoming our team that are all here to assist you with a wide variety of technical needs and schedules that work for you. Thanks. This is George the Tech.